YouTubers, ghost hunters, no matter how big or small, the shape is coming for you all. The truth will stand when the world's on fire. The shape isn't one person. The shape is a literal army. Nobody's safe. That shadow over your shoulder, it doesn't seem to move the same way that you do. I'll be there. We will be there. We're coming. We're watching. Us analyzers are everywhere. Us debunkers are everywhere. You can't hide. Hey everybody, it's The Shape, back with another video. Now before we get into the video real quick, I just want to say I'm not organized at all. We're on a roll though, I mean, I'm, I've been consistent this whole year, and a big reason for that is Patreon. You guys are awesome. And not to mention, everybody's donated on PayPal, and even that new thing, super comment, super thanks. Unbelievable. So, real quick. If you've done any of those uh, paying type donations, Patreon, whatever, comment below what you would like to see for paying members. Because, like I said, I'm unorganized and I really want to show you guys how much I appreciate that. And real quick, that being said, I've had uh, subscribers say, you know, I wish I could donate, or the fact you watch, uh, that means more to me than you'll ever know. That does pay me. Uh, so don't be sorry. If anything, I owe you. Because you guys are awesome, each and every one of you. In fact, you just watch. And comment and like. Huh? Real quick, that being said, I've had uh, subscribers say, you know, I wish I could donate, or the fact you watch, uh, that means more to me than you'll ever know. That does pay me. Uh, so don't be sorry. If anything, I owe you. Because you guys are awesome, each and every one of you. In fact, you just watch and comment and like. Huh? We are back, and welcome back to another Spooky Sunday, you absolute bloody legends. Today, we've got something that we feel we need to talk to you guys about, and uh, we just want your input, your help with this, because it's been a little while since we've had, um, we'll call it an episode, since we've had an episode. Ugh, I'm sorry. But that's another thing I, I wanted to mention as well. We need your help, he says. Ben there, our buddy Ben. We need your help. No, he, he needs your interaction. Needs those comments. To help push the video. I'm just going to play the footage for you guys because I feel like the footage talks for itself. It just it explains absolutely everything. Now, uh, the footage starts around 5 to 11. I'm just looking at it now and it finishes. Well, the last recording is at quarter past 11. Oh, now, as being blabs throughout the whole video, he said a lot of times it's pointless stuff that he says, but something very interesting he's getting ready to say. And I want you guys to listen to it closely because this whole video is based on it. Well, 2314. So there's about 20 minutes of things happening. The footage does kind of run all the way through that 20 minutes, roughly. Listen closely. Uh, but obviously because it's uh, the cameras only pick up when there's motion and it stops recording when it stops motion, there are little bits where, you know, the times will jump. Um, just because the camera stopped recording and then when something happened, it re started re-recording again. Okay, let's remember he said that. What he's saying is, once the camera detects motion, it starts recording. Then when whatever motion stops, I guess it waits a second or two and then it quits recording. That way when you go back to watch, you can see, I guess, all the falls of movement. Let's hear it one more time though. Um just because the camera stopped recording and then when something happened it re started re-recording again. again so you know that's why there will be jumps in the time it's not solid 20 minutes of just recording uh hmm i wonder if this will come back and uh i wonder if this will come back and bite him right in the ass 
It's a shape video. Of course it will. Now, we start off in a spooky kitchen. I'm sorry. But, all jokes aside, uh, a trash can that's getting ready to be knocked over by a poltergeist, demon, whatever it is in his home. But I noticed something, and I zoomed in on it. Now, I want you to take a look, and then I'm going to show you what I found. Okay, granted, that's a quickie, okay? But I, I, I want you to look at the very bottom of the entire camera, the very bottom mid. Let's zoom in. I want to show you something. Now, the reason I mentioned that, no, it's not necessarily like this big debunk, but I noticed like back when I'm editing videos, if I put like two of me in a video, right? And then I want to buffer the two together because this color won't be color time like this one. You can uh, buffer it. But when you buffer the two of them, yes, it makes the center right here look good. But the very outside of the entire image doesn't look so good so when you do it you have to zoom in a bit now i'm not saying that's what it is but that's an imperfection and it shouldn't be there now on that table you're getting ready to see a glass uh, like a glass you drink out of you're getting ready to see it move across the table now later on in the video not necessarily right now i'm going to point out something that really stood out to me not this particular clip, but you guys see things that I don't. So comment below if you see anything, but look at this clip. Now the camera goes to another room and this is where the rubber meets the road, so to speak. I want you to really, really pay attention to the timestamp because he says himself, Ben says it jumps around it starts recording when something starts moving, and then it quits when it don't. But I found something else. Keep paying attention, ladies and gentlemen. I'm going to brighten the image for you because for some reason you guys see stuff that I don't even see. But let me brighten it. We'll watch it one more time together, but then I'll point out things that I see. Coming up, ladies and gentlemen, that door, when it opens, that door where the mirror fell, there's a door right there. When it opens, watch this very closely and keep your eye on the time down there. Did you see that? The camera didn't turn on and the mirror move. No, no, no. The mirror literally teleports. And there's a 16 second gap. That's an edit. That is a cut. Because he probably saw something in the video that he didn't want nobody else to see. Because you remember right out of Ben's mouth, the camera records when something starts moving. 
Well, explain the teleport, Ben. Coming up, it's about to teleport, and you're going to lose 16 seconds. Bam. Well, see, stuff like that is just blows my mind that people believe that garbage because it's garbage. Make no mistake about it. Now, I can under I can understand people falling for it that aren't don't know about editing and uh, masking or any of that stuff. But if you watch a video of mine and you still believe that stuff that he puts out, any of it, there's no hope for you. What adult believes that stuff? Oh, by the way, there'll be a secret word in this video. Now, coming up again, there is another cut. Why? Because the mirror, it doesn't move and turn the camera on. No, 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 it teleports again. Five seconds, that's unaccounted for. Now Ben says, when something moves, the camera turns on, but this goes poof and teleports. Oh, one thing about mirrors, they're really shiny. Like the whole mirror, not just the mirror itself, but the little, you know, whatever the mirror is attached to, the metal brass, copper, steel, whatever. It's shiny. And you can get reflections. Let's zoom in. Another thing I noticed, the base of the mirror right there, there's a shadow. Did you see it? Did you kind of see that reflection in there? Because I can see it pretty good. Now, before Ben says the teleportation two times, that was just the camera technical difficulties. Okay, let's see this part because it's working just fine on this part. Ah, oh, in the kitchen again, where you, you've seen that glass move, obviously. That's, that's crazy, man. I'm, I, think about this. It's through knives at them, glasses. It can pick up anything and throw it. Any utensil, picture frames or whatever, but it don't scare them none. Why? Because they're used to it, apparently. But here's what I say. If a ghost, spirit, demon, whatever, poltergeist, can pick a knife up and throw it, which in your videos they had multiple times, pick up anything and throw it. Then a ghost can take that same knife while you're asleep and do some Charles Manson type stuff. I'd be out of there. I also noticed in a lot of his, uh, Lynn and ba <laughs> Lynn and Baney, Ben and Laney. I've also noticed a lot of their clips. When something moves or whatever, you start seeing imperfections, blurriness, darkening, and everything. It only happens during the paranormal. I want you to take a look at this freeze frame and this freeze frame. One of them is right before the cup moves. It's all dark and blurry. And as soon as the cup starts moving, it becomes clear. 
Hmm. My question is, why does it go from blurry to clear as soon as the paranormal starts happening? Maybe it's the camera. I'm not sure, but let me know below. At this point, Lainey had woken me up because she was hearing all of these knocks and bangs downstairs and she was starting to get quite concerned. Uh, she wasn't sure whether it was someone in the house or whether it was baby. <laughs> so she sent me down to check it out. And that's when I started recording. I started record. Well, you can hear me kind of going down the stairs. I started recording at the top of the stairs. All right, Ben, let me get this straight. You hear thumping and movement downstairs in your house and it wakes you up. Instead of feeling concerned, there may be an intruder in your home. You're like, oh, no, no it's a poltergeist. Uh, don't worry about it. That makes no sense whatsoever. You guys take this fake poltergeist stuff and you monetize it. Because the beginning of all your videos and the end of them, you're promoting Instagram, TikTok. This stuff happens all the time. You have the most haunted house on planet Earth. You have proof this stuff happens nearly every day. Enough to where you can promote three social media pages or more and get evidence all the time. Yet, it doesn't concern you. Let's just profit off of it. Makes no sense to me whatsoever. I'd be concerned. Oh my god, let me rub my eyes 75 times and mess my hair up a little bit throughout this whole video so you know that I have just woke up. He does that through the whole video. He's walking around like he's staggering. Stop. About 11 o'clock, right? Me and Lainey have just been fast asleep. And Lainey's just woken me up to tell me that she's heard bangs from downstairs now. You know, if a ghost can throw knives and utensils and throw pictures and all that stuff, then they can pick up a knife and they can stab you while you sleep. But you, you guys don't seem concerned because it gives you a following on all your social medias. It's just like rubbing his eyes, blah, 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 blah. And stop licking your lips there, LL Cool J. Now, guys... If you're an adult and you've watched one of my videos and you still believe that this this family is being haunted, I feel really sorry for you. Oh my god, look at the state of the face. Lane's gonna kill me for Ah, oh, there's more through here as well. Brilliant. Oh my god. Shit everywhere. Fuck's sake. That should be up there. And... <sighs> yeah, Ben, you should know where that mirror goes, you damn wit, because you're the one that knocked it off there to begin with. And that was it. That was the activity that, that was going on. Now, um, fortunately, there was no one downstairs. Well, there was. There was Dave and Andy, but, you know, nobody physical downstairs, which was fine but the reason we wanted to make a video from this and the reason we wanted to talk to you guys about this was because it's been a long time since we've had activity like this <laughs> uh, sorry, comment below but uh, if somebody's got an itchy nose and they keep licking their lips because they got dry mouth is that not a sign of deception i could be wrong i'm no body language expert um Basically, we used to get activity like this all the time before we knew Dave or Andy. And when we found out about them and we started interacting with them, it all kind of mellowed out. We want to ask you guys what you think of this. Like, because you guys seem to be much more clued up on this kind of thing than we are. I gotta say it. Your audience is much more knowledgeable about something that for last year, you got the most haunted house on the planet. Planet Earth, and stuff happens every day. Yet they should know more about it than you do. On what 
planet or solar system, does that make any sense? Ben. Oh my goodness. I, I, I can feel myself getting dumber by watching this. I mean, I'm serious. It, it's insane to me. You know, you, you have mirrors that teleport. I can't imagine how scary that is for you guys. Anyway, after this part of the video, you know what the next part of the video is. I'm going to read super comments. And, yeah, I appreciate you guys. Oh, and the secret word, the secret word is sock. You know, like a sock you put on your foot. Anyway, I love you guys, and y'all come back now, you hear? Okay, if you guys made it this far, you uh, donated, whether it's PayPal or Super Comments. Well, Super Comments this time, just, you guys are awesome. Trent Bennett, I love all your stuff. I love all the stuff you do, brother. You've really opened my eyes to the fakers who I once supported. I always continue to support you for keeping up the awesome work. Trent, you've been an OG for a while. You have went above and beyond a long time, and I really appreciate you. Paranormal Road Trip says, Great debunk as always, although I gotta say, some of her activity are pretty horribly done, as bad as her acting. Yeah, we're talking about the... Okay. That even a beginner debunker would have caught some of the more obvious ones. Really cheap, like press on nails. That one clip where all the things moved at the same time, yeah, that's a tricky one. But since her credibility is shot, I can't take that serious anyway. Another great debunk shape, awesome. Thumbs up. Thank you, Paranormal Road Trip. I appreciate it. Mominator 7. Again? I was suspicious of her videos from the very beginning as well as disappointed by yet another fraudulent faker, CLPC is what we're talking about, because her acting was as fake sounding and awful as press on nails are fake. Looking. And cheap. Yeah, they're cheap. Not that I buy them. Thank you for shedding light on yet another fake. Keep up the great work. Mominator7, thank you very much. Miss Virginia, Writes, thanks for the fun, this fun video. You explain it so that it makes sense. You mean, you mean no harm, but just calling it like it is. And do it nicely. Looking forward to the next one. Much love. Miss Virginia, much love. Thank you very much. I try to, try to make it fun, yet real, yet a little bit weird sometimes. Wreaking havoc, right? Thanks, Shape. I never thought Sylvia's videos were real because why? Who do you record and how do you re why do you record and not um, run? That's what I've been saying. Run so hard that your press on nails flip off and scatter. Off camera, of course. I see what he did there. Thank you, Freaking Havoc. Dia Urisk. Hope I pronounced that right. Love to debunk. Some of the guys irritate me so much that I clench my fist so bad. My press on nails come off. LOL. I do that sometimes. Karen Hasty again. Thanks. Love watching debunking these fake channels. Love from the UK. Love from the US. Russell Willett writes, Thanks. Honestly, I really wanted to be on a video. But also, it helps with making video. I only wish I could donate a couple thousand. Because your content is freaking worth it. Let's go. All right. My wife can skip her nail appointment and just buy some press-on nails. Either she's also gorgeous. Sorry, that was random. Hey. Thanks, Russell. Hey, Shade. This is Trent Bennett. Russell Willett, you're huh? Hmm. Um. Uh. Anyway, I went through comments and picked a random subscriber and this is in his con he wrote this is me trying to help you reach out more of your subscribers if they can donate and shape trust me i'm not saying you don't literally reply to everyone but this super this super chat donation is for him press on nails i always love seeing new trent you're awesome dude i see what you did there i appreciate you 
land 15 rights. Spider-Man coming in, finding that string, LOL. You gotta love it. You gotta love it. Thank you, Lab 15. Another OG been here since inception of the channel. Nico Pluto writes, thanks for what you do, weirdo. <laughs> you know me well. Thank you, Nico. Just Chill writes, your channel is shaping up nicely. Our channel, Just Chill. And thank you. Werewolf Ghost writes, thanks. Short and sweet. I appreciate you, Werewolf Ghost. That's awfully nice of you. Seriously, thank you very much. Trent Bennett again. <laughs> Gotta love this guy. Another one just because I can, smiley face. I appreciate you, Trent. As always, man, it's unreal the support you show. I appreciate it. Nico Pluto writes, thanks with, wow, a $50 donation. Insane. I appreciate that very much. I'm going to name a piece of equipment after you. Call it the Nico Spirit Box or something. Wendy writes, thanks. Thank you, Wendy. I really appreciate that. Uh, thank you a lot. Gina writes, love you, Shape. Here always to support you. It's not much, but sent with love. Close hanger. Gina, it ain't the amount. It's the fact that you went above and beyond anyway. I appreciate that very much. Very, very much. And also, guys, I got one shout out. I didn't forget. Paranormal Elite wanted me to shout out his sister, Krista, who watches the channel as well. So shout out to you both. I appreciate you very, very much. Now, this video may not have been the most awesome debunk on the planet, but I got some really awesome ones coming up. This one I wanted to get out because it, it just, sometimes they hit you in just these weird ways that kind of make you grr. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you guys know me. Keep that same energy. You dig? Anyway, that's the video, guys. And as always, I'll see you in the next video coming very, 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 very soon. Thank you, and y'all come back now, you hear?